thinking that it's intentional because it doesn't look like the typical injuries we see when dogs get hit by car or dog attacks. Baron is doing remarkably well considering his injuries. They are in the process of healing now, so as he heals, um, trying to see whether there's any kind of reconstruction that we need to have done on his nose because that's the area that's most concerned for us. I got a text saying, found our next dog, <laughs> and I'm like, really? And I was pretty mortified that somebody could take that out on a defenseless animal. I'm glad to be taking him home to his forever home. It's a great feeling. Not so much that we chose him. This morning's reaction when we first met, I think, shows that he chose us as well. There's been an incredible amount of outrage uh, over Barron. This is an infuriating case for me. It angers me. How can someone do this? People who are capable of committing these type of unspeakable acts are dangers in our community. We need information on who did this. That's critical to, to our ability to find justice for Barron. Hey, sweetheart. 